So recently, we have been getting AI in lots of products, then why do we leave phone gimbals behind? Zhiyun Tech introduces new Smooth Pi as phone gimbal with all the new AI capabilities. Now before we get into this video, I just want to let you know that Zhiyun did send me this gimbal for review but no money exchange hands and I will give you my honest reviews on this product. So let's start with the form factor. This is not going to be your small compact phone gimbal. This series focused more on robust setups for more professional use compared to their compact Q series. This means that it has a lot of features to get a lot of creative shots with it and the overall grip and the size makes it easy to handle in different situations. Now, as you can see, it was very windy here in this location when I shot this scene, but gimbal was holding perfectly and the grip was very smooth. Now let's talk about all of its features. It has different shooting modes such as pan follow, lock, point of view, vortex, and that will allow you to use gimbal for various different shot styles. It also comes with built-in flashlight for any nighttime scene. They also made it easy to lock and unlock the gimbal with this quicker solution that holds the gimbal in the place. And the biggest change in the SmoothFi SAI is the new attachment that magnetizes on top of your gimbal, which helps with any tracking shots that you would take. And by just using these simple gestures, you could turn on and off for your recordings. You can enable or disable tracking, which will works really well in this test. And as you can see, it's really snappy and detects gestures and right subjects in matter of seconds. And that also works really well even if you go too far from it. And I think it's much more reliable than just using camera app tracking which didn't really work well for me. Speaking of app, you can pair this gimbal with the ZY Cam app and it will give you a lot more control in shooting such as zooming using this knob, tracking or changing any camera settings. And this app also comes handy when you want to update your gimbal and as soon as you turn on your gimbal, it gives you message to start using this app directly but what you get is the gimbal mini tripod and cable to charge your device while it's on use the battery life with full charge on this gimbal would last until seven hours with the use of their ai and fill light which i think is pretty good enough for all day of use now if you have been enjoying this content so far then definitely consider liking and subscribing as it helps me to buy me a dinner now in terms of all the shooting style you could easily change from landscape mode to portrait mode by rotating the phone holder and by triple clicking the trigger button, it goes into this selfie mode. And you can also attach this AI device in both directions and then you can choose which camera you would like to use for AI tracking. And on this side of this gimbal, you can also attach your own mic to complete the whole vlogging setup. I would say the overall use of material doesn't feel cheap at all and even if though it's plastic, everything just looks and feels really well made. And especially what I really like about is this transparent areas that you get all over this gimbal, which is a nice accent. And this three axis gimbal structure definitely helps with all those bumps that you get that definitely gives that more robust professional look to this gimbal. It's still built really well and it feels very sturdy especially when it's super windy. And as you can see here phone gimbals definitely help to get those steady shots instead of without using any phone gimbal. But there were also few things that I would like Zhiyun to improve upon and first would be a brighter display or a backlit which shows which shooting mode I am on because when I was outside it's really hard to see what mode I am on since backlit wasn't too bright. And the second thing would be a stronger magnet for AI attachment because as you can see you could possibly lose this if you bump into something while using gimbal as it happened with me where I would be taking my phone off the gimbal and it fell off in the water and I know I could have been more careful with where I was standing so it's my fault as well but stronger magnet would definitely help for sure and in terms of price if you just want to get this gimbal and not the whole combo kit then it's going to cost you $169 USD and I'll also post a link to this gimbal in the description so definitely check it out for yourself and let me know what you think about the phone gimbals and until then check out these other videos too and i'll see you in the next one